So basically, um, what I was thinking of was, um, oh f I can't believe you've done this. Uh, Tails, why did you quietly close the door? Knuckles, I was gonna go downstairs to get myself some chocolate until I noticed that we have a robber that's stealing stuff from our kitchen! Whoa, a robber's in our house? Yes! Shh! But I don't want us to get caught, so let's just quietly go downstairs and find out who it is, okay? Okay, well, let's go. Ah! Come on! No! Uh, okay, maybe it's here. Maybe it's somewhere around here. Uh, no! Uh, so much useless crap! Okay, where is this son of a bee? Knuckles, what are you doing? Hey, Tails. What? I think I'm falling in love with her. What? Why? Knuckles, you only saw her for a few seconds and all of a sudden you're attracted to her? It's love at first sight. Knuckles, you don't know where she came from. She probably broke out of jail or out of a mental institution. She could be a psychopath. You never know. She could be dangerous. Hmm, yeah, she could be dangerous. Knuckles, this isn't the time for your god-awful jokes! Okay, well, can you at least help me talk to her? What? Why? Because I'm so nervous! I'm so nervous around hot girls that you could easily confuse me for Swiss cheese! Uh, this is going to be the death of me, I swear to god! Hey, lady! Lady! Hey, lady! Destroying our stuff! Listen! My friend Knuckles Hi. wants to meet you since he thinks you're hot as Swiss cheese. Oh, really? E yeah. Uh, Knuckles, introduce yourself to Rouge. Rouge and Rouge, introduce yourself to Knuckles. And unlike our friend Sonic, he doesn't chuckle. Um, hello. What? Knuckles, just say hi to her. <coughs> Knuckles, it's so simple. Just say hello. <coughs> hmm, I think it's better if I just leave. <coughs> oh, wait, he's trying to tell you something. Well, what is it, Knuckles? <coughs> <laughs> what are you saying? Oh my god, um, I think Knuckles wants to... Give you a talk back! What? No! Um, he wanted to see a real live pig! <gasps> excuse me, excuse me, excuse you! No way! Uh, he wants to... Is that true, Knuckles? You want to take me out on a date? Yeah. What do you say? Well, I could give it a shot and see if it goes well. <gasps> That's great. Now get out of here before I call the police. <sighs> Man, I... What? Where does she go? Uh, did you not see the wings on her? Duh, she's a bat. A really, really dirty bat that can easily whack balls to another baseball game. <laughs> okay, calm down, Chuckles. Hey! Have... Have I got deaf?
What? Okay, Knuckles. Are you ready to date a potentially dangerous psychopath? You bet I am. Took a shower? Check. Brushed your teeth? Check. Had some breath mints? Check. Had a slap in the face? What? No. There you go. What? What was that for? It's to calm you down after what happened this afternoon. Oh, okay. Well, wish me luck, Tails. I'm gonna need it. <gasps> okay. <laughs> What am I doing? Oh, Knuckles! That cappuccino was lovely! <laughs> I don't think I could have another sip. Oh, I sure doubt that, babe. <laughs> You're spoiling me, Knuckles. I like it. Oh, I'll spoil you until the day you die. <laughs> yeah, although it is weird that of all the places to have a date at, you decide to go with Starbucks. Yeah, I'd probably try something different. Man, that coffee at the spot. Oh, well, what I'm trying to tell you, Knuckles, is I'm... Hey, sir, your fancy pantsy limousine is ready. Great! Hey, Roos, take a peek at your limousine. Um, okay, well... It's just a taxi. Even better, sweetie. Um, not really. I mean, a limousine has food and drinks alongside some comfortable seats and heck, even a small TV. Well, it's a taxi is... Well, why are we even talking? Your episode awaits. Well... <whistles> ah! You'll never ever have to walk again, babe. <sighs> Here's your bill, sir. Thank you, waiter. What? 20 bucks for a cup of coffee and a cappuccino? Are you actually freaking kidding me right now? Oh, my mistake. Thank you for pointing that out. Here's the actual bill, sir. Thank you. You spend two thousand bucks on a cup of coffee and a cappuccino. Oh, Tails, don't even get me started on how much it costs just to get a freaking taxi. <laughs> Man, our economy is seriously messed up. Oh, Tails, I couldn't help but spend every single penny I had just to make her happy. I, I couldn't control myself. I'm all over her, Tails. I'm all over her. <laughs> I don't know, Tails. I have another date tomorrow. I'm so brain dead, I don't know what to do! <laughs> well, Knuckles, I don't really know what to say other than to just break up with her. She's no good! She robbed our house, for God's sake! <gasps> Wait a minute. I have an idea. I'm going to put you in charge of my money. What? What? You come along with me on a date and make sure that I don't spend any money on some random crap. But Knuckles, I'm just a little kid. You have no idea what I could do with this. Oh, don't worry, Tails. I'm going to make sure you don't waste my money. Or else I'm going to give you a Knuckles sandwich. Okay, message is clear. Good. I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Okay, Tails, make sure you remember this. We're going to keep it cheap by going to the park, and no matter how much I beg or cry, you do not offer me any money. But give me a little penny so I can... No, nope. there you go. You'll do perfectly fine. Uh, no. 
Knuckles, I think I spotted your date. What? Where? She's outside in our garden. Well, how did she get in our garden? With her wings. Duh. Okay, smart Alec. Well, let's go outside and meet her. Wait a minute. Tails, I need you to go to a store and get her a gift. Nope. What? No, Tails, it's rude to not get her a gift. I need to get her something in order to make her happy. But, but you just said... Tails, she's a very classy lady with a very classy attitude. Do you think she would appreciate a man that doesn't offer her any gifts? Hello? Is anybody here? Hurry, Tails, please! Oh my god, Knuckles! <sighs> Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, here comes nothing. Here we go. Hey, babe, you look beautiful as ever. <laughs> That's funny. I thought I saw your friend through the door, but now he's gone? Yeah, um, he will be right back. He's going to be our personal assistant for today. Okay... Oh, um, will you excuse me? I have to take this phone call. I'll be right back. Take all the time you need, babe. Take all the time you need. <sighs> hey, Knuckles. I didn't really know what she wanted me to get her since you weren't really specific, so I thought I'd get her something classy, like deodorant. What? What? I got a gift. For Root. Tails, what the frick? You promised me you weren't going to waste any of my money on useless crap! But Knuckles, you just said- <sighs> Sorry about that. Hey, Rouge, I got you a little present. Oh, deodorant. That's sweet. And I also got you some chocolate. What chocolate? Tails, where's the chocolate? Knuckles, what do you want from me? Tails, how is Rue supposed to be fulfilled if you don't give her a little treat? Now hurry! Hi! Okay, Knuckles, I bought some chocolate. Tails, I have a serious question. Does money grow on trees? No. Does money grow on plants? No. Does money grow out of my buttocks? No. Then why the heck are you wasting off my body? Uh, Knuckles? Here's the chocolate I promised you. Now what are we going to do, Sadie? Go to the park, get some food, dancing, a vacation to a beach? Knuckles, you said you were just going for a walk at the park, remember? Hmm, I think a walk at the park sounds good enough. Man, is it dry around here? Is it just me? Cloud above water, Tails! I think she's just talking about the garden. Tails, a dry garden pales in comparison to a woman having a dry mouth! Snuggles, may I suggest? Buy a ball of water and get out! Okay! Don't worry, darling! I'll help you! <laughs> Just talking about your dull looking garden. I already have a bottle of water with me. Already had a water bottle. Did you hear that, Miles? We didn't need to buy one! And how much did it cost for you to buy that water bottle? 65 cents? 65 cents, okay. Well, I guess that's 65 cents I'm never going to get back! What's the matter with you? Are you trying to do this to upset me? Uh, do you seriously think that I'm made of money? What is the matter with you? I'm sorry, Knuckles, but you constantly tell me to buy things for Rouge, and all I'm trying to do is help you. I'm so baffled, I don't even know why I'm doing this. Gosh darn it! Tails, I'm so sorry. I, I should have known that you were only trying to help me, and... I was at the heat of a moment, and it was my fault that I put you for this, and... I'm so sorry, Tails. I, I didn't mean to hurt you. From this point on, I won't ask you to buy anything for Rouge. I promise, Tails. I promise. Tails! Rouge needs a few perfume! 
Do you seriously think that we're in the money? Babe needs a new pair of socks. I'm going to punch you so hard until you're burning in hell. My sweet honey needs a new notebook. Not that one. Try hold out. Try hold out. Try hold out. you doing just laying down on the ground? Arr, I swear to God, if you don't get up in the next few seconds, I'm gonna punch you so hard until you'll be screaming like such a- All right! Don't tell me! You want me to go run back to the store and get her some crap that she doesn't need, then you want me to go run back and forth like a madman so you could just end up saying, Oh, Tails, you waste my money one more time and I'm gonna punch you to the North Pole. And then I'll be like, Oh, Knuckles, how am I supposed to make you feel happy if all you ever do is constantly get me death threats? Then you'll say that if I don't end up getting her a gift, that that'll just make me an uncultured, uncaring swine! So do you want me to get her some more unnecessary junk, or not? Uh... You better make up your mind or else I'll be leaving right now. Tails, this is important to me. Rouge needs this in order for this to be a successful day. So are we gonna go to the park now or what? Please, I'm gonna be lost. I beg of you, please. I'm a lonely person that actually managed to find a possible true love. Please don't let me lose her. Please, please, please don't let me lose her. <laughs> Knuckles, please, please don't cry. <laughs> now you're gonna make me feel bad. Wait, I have an idea. I, I think this will be great. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, Knuckles, cheer up, because I ended up getting the ultimate gift! The Nintendo Switch! Tails, how am I supposed to cheer up and be happy? When all you're doing is wasting all my gosh darn money! See? You just did it again! Tails, I just can't help it. You're way too soft on money. It's fine with me because I actually have self-control. Whilst you? You think money grows on trees when in actuality, it doesn't. So really, I think the person to blame for all of this is you. But do you think the switch will be effective for her? You know what, Knuckles? You want to know what a narcissist is? A narcissist is a piece of sh like you who easily thinks that they can have a bunch of glory through demands and requests when in actuality lacks empathy for other people's feelings and just ends up being a horrible, egotistical <gasps> monster. So maybe, just maybe, you could take some of your demands and requests and shove it right up your hairy a alongside your gosh darn wallet! You know what? This isn't gonna work out. What? What? Knuckles, I have a confession to make. T well, what is it? Well, to put it simply, I'm a gold digger. What? What's a gold digger? A gold digger is when a person has a relationship with someone specifically for their money and other expensive things. So what are you saying? You don't love me? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. But, 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 but I thought 
that you loved me. What? Why do you think I love you? You're gross. You're weird, and overall, you're very unpleasant looking. But, but I, I thought this was going to work out. I mean, I spent a lot of money on a lot of things. And it's not delicate, knuckles. It's not jewelry. It's not money. It's not fancy. And overall, the stuff you got me is very cheap. Well, I think some people would find this nice. I mean, it's not enough, Knuckles. So you're saying that the stuff I've done for you is not enough, and I I'm not enough? Well, I guess not. Well, I guess Tails was right. She is no good. I mean, she broke into our house to steal money. She only dated me for money, and only liked me because of money. Oh, God. What on earth am I doing? What kind of a person am I? Okay, are you going to talk to your imaginary friend all day or what? <laughs> Ow! Bye, piggy! Now we have to make things right. Where's Tails? Tails! Tails! Tails? Hey, Tails. Hey, Narcissist. I just want to apologize after what I've been putting you through, and I should have known that you're only trying to help me, but it's done. What's done? Me and Rouge, I'm done with her. It was my fault for not realizing that she was a... gold digger. You see? I told you there was something fishy about her. Yeah, but what can I say? My IQ is the size of a fruit fly. Boy, you could say that again. Yeah, but I just wanted to say I'm sorry for verbally hurting you and... Heck, I'll be your personal assistant for today and I'll do anything you want me to do in order for us to be friends again, if that's okay with you. Act like that one more time, and I'll give you a knuckle sandwich. Okay, deal. Okay, well, how about we go to the mall and maybe pick up some frozen yogurt or something? Okay, but this time it's all on me. Wait, what? Tails, where's my wallet? I don't know, maybe it's... <gasps> no! What, what? What is it? I might have angrily thrown your wallet to Rouge after you told me I didn't have self-control with other people's money. Ironic? <gasps> Ugh, screw him! God, I can't believe I put myself through all this. I just wanted to steal his money and run off. Gosh, is that so much to ask for? Ugh, but at least I got to steal his wallet, so at least that's something. Ugh, all right, what does he have in there? money in here at all? Why did I suffer through all this for nothing?